Okay, so the idea with this strap that the Hayate comes with, I mean, you can use it to carry, but the idea with it is it transfers the weight. So ordinarily, without the strap, if you're just using the pole saw like this, you're going to activate your neck muscles. And so this is basically the muscle that you're going to be using to lift the pole up and down, predominantly down, because that's when it cuts. But that's the muscle that's going to be activated. If you put this little wrist strap on and sort of have it leaning against the base of the wrist there and have that sort of nice and tight, it should activate your bicep. Mine's not too impressive, but you can sort of see that by putting that pressure, it activates your arm muscles, where we're much stronger with our bicep normally anyway, or that's where you're not going to get as much fatigue. And then by using it that way, you're transferring the weight to your arms opposed to your neck. So that's the idea with the strap. And then you'll notice also on the end of the pole here, they've got another one, like a loop. So you can move that strap from there down to the end if you have the pole sort of at maximum capacity and you want to, whoops, hit the roof, but use it right at the end there. So that's why there's a loop at both ends and that's why they put that strap on.